Greetings, my name is Mark Hoverson and welcome to this video. Back in 2007, my wife and I purchased a Platinum Travel Membership with Global Resorts Network. Today, after using my membership to take the kids hiking through the jungles of Hawaii, playing in the ocean in California, dancing in Mexico, introducing my wife to Minnie Mouse for the first time, taking kids exploring through the mountains, I'm more convinced than ever that buying my Platinum Membership, although it was expensive to us at the time, has been the single greatest purchase I've made in my entire life. Let me explain. Here's a snapshot that compares our private club pricing versus Expedia's public pricing for the exact same resort. What we're looking at is the Wyndham Cypress Palms. It's a two bedroom unit. And it's got a full kitchen, two bedrooms, two baths, deck, dining room, living room, the whole thing. And it's next to Disney, so it's gonna be priced a little bit higher. If you look, February 10th to February 17th, $5,227.81. Again, this is on premium real estate. Expedia's best price, this is public pricing, $5,227. But if you take a snapshot inside our membership, you'll see the Wyndham Cypress Palms. It's the exact date. February 10th to February 17th, it's the exact unit, exact resort, two bedroom unit. $546, that's 89.6% cheaper. And with approaching $5,000 in savings, it allows me to take the kids to Disney. That's an example of how it makes Disney doable for families. Let's take another look inside the club. Here's the Wyndham Branson at the Meadows. And if you look inside the condo, you'll see it's got the breakfast bar, it's got a deck, it's got the living room, dining area, and then down the hall is two bedrooms and two bathrooms. Branson is known as the Heartlands version of Disney. It's famous for theater, water parks for the kids, and lakes, and just country good times. Again, you'll see Expedia's very best price for a the two bedroom unit in a prime early summer week, which was May 20th to May 27th. Expedia's best price, $4,119.54. That's the Expedia's public price. Now, if you look inside, our Global Resorts Network membership, the Wyndham Bransom at the Meadows, the exact same day as May 20th to May 27th. The two bedroom unit sleeps six people. Some For some people, that's two families. For us, it's just one. But the price, $398. That's for the exact resort, the exact prime dates, the exact unit, except it's 91% off Expedia's very best price. And again, at prices like this, it allows me to go on vacation and it's what it does for its members. Now at this point a lot of people ask how is this pricing even possible? Well let's pretend that this is one of the Wyndham's like the Wyndham Cypress Palm that we looked at and this is a very poor drawing of it but um, they have to bring people into the condo and they have they have pretty much three ways that they do it. Number one is through timeshare purchase and timeshare purchases for a single week of ownership at the Wyndham is about eighteen thousand dollars plus you're gonna have maintenance fees that hover around seven hundred dollars so that's one way they do it and that's expensive because it's an it's a deed for ownership and there's legalities and there's uh, there's a lot of work that goes into there's a lot of people that have to get paid vendors that bring couples in there um, enticements that they have to pay for it's a very expensive thing which is why ownership at that resort costs as much as it does but then when we talk about Expedia and Travelocity here's and pay super close attention here's how we beat Expedia and Travelocity by up to 90 percent because when someone when the resort gets exposure on Expedia and Travelocity or Hotels.com or Bookit.com a lot of times we think that Expedia or Travelocity is like Google where if you search for condos near Disney in Expedia just like Google, Expedia pulls down and searches the web and then out of the goodness of their heart, they pull up the very best deal. Well, that's what we think and that's what I used to think, but as I got into the industry a little bit deeper, I realized that Expedia and Travelocity are pretty much a sophisticated classified ad platform. So what happens is when someone searches condos near Disney, Expedia goes down and pulls up the advertiser who paid the very most amount of money for exposure and whoever paid the most amount of money gets the top spot. So what happens is this resort has to put in a six figure plus contract to get exposure for all their resorts on Expedia and what happens is the price has to increase to compensate 
for the advertising cost, which has to compensate for when you see the traveling gnome commercials during Super Bowls and during things. Those are millions of dollars that Travelocity and Expedia are spending for exposure, and the price just keeps escalating and escalating and escalating, so it's $5,000 by the time a consumer gets to go on that condo. But our travel club acts as like a super client, and what we have is we have thousands upon thousands of hungry, avid, eager travelers. But here's the thing. Inside our club, we pay $398 for the week up to $799 per week. But the cool thing is, with our initiation fee, it funds an admin that goes to these resorts and negotiates the lowest possible deal. So what we're able to do is tell this resort, listen, you can get exposure, and I know this this is getting a little messy now, but it, we say you can get risk-free, meaning it doesn't cost any advertising, and we'll give your resort exposure to our club, but we're only going to send you $500 per unit, but we can fill up 10 units per week, all week, every year, all year, and we negotiate with these things. So what happens is our club becomes a super entity and we create more volume for the resort in a risk-free fashion. This is how we're able to get prices at $398 versus $4,000. But let's get out of America real quick and go into Mexico. So here's Cabo Villas Beach Resort and Spa. It's actually a four-star property. If you look at Expedia's best price guarantee, You'll see for a premium, you know, cold escaping week, January 28th to February 4th, it's $2,274.37. So about $2,200 for seven nights, about $285 per night. But if you look up here inside our member price in Cabo Villas Beach Resort, January 28th to February 4th, the one bedroom unit, exact same unit, exact same dates, exact same everything, $398. That's 82.5% off Expedia. And Cabo is renowned for its whale watching, deep sea fishing, and just pure relaxation, authentic mariachi bands, the whole thing. Let's flip to the other side of Mexico and look at the Grand Mayan Riviera Maya. If you look at Hotels.com, and again, remember, all the expense that Hotels.com does in advertising passes on to the resorts that advertise with them. So the Grand Mayan Riviera Maya Resort, which is right by Playa del Carmen, which is renowned for its scuba diving, its ancient Mayan pyramids, is a really great place. I've, I've done it all there in Cancun. It wasn't available because this is a premium winter getaway, February 3rd through February 10th. But look at how much it is per night, $584 per night when it is available. That's $4,088 plus tax for a premium winter getaway to the Grand Mayan Riviera Maya. But look inside our club. February 3rd to February 10th, the one bedroom unit, $398. That's 90.3% off retail. Let's take a look at another Mayan palace, the Mayan Palace Rocky Point, also known as the Porto Panasco. If you were to do a December 18th to December 25th online at bookit.com, it's the two-bedroom unit. It's right on the Sea of Cortez. The public price, $3,023.41. But if you look inside our club, you've got the exact same dates, December 18th to December 25th, the two-bedroom unit. $398 for the identical everything. And if you take a look here, the Mayans are known for their long, sprawling pools next to great beaches. And this is the Sea of Cortez, which is loaded with sea bass, yellowtail, mackerel, flounder, and the resort concierge can set you up with a fishing expedition, no problem. There's also a championship golf course on site too. And I've actually used this membership to take my kid to the Mayan Palace. And here's a little clip where a mariachi band cleared out and played just for my son and I, and this is just a little clip of us dancing. bottom line is that with prices this low, it's caused me and it's caused other members to go on vacations that just wouldn't exist otherwise and create memories that are really some of the best stuff of our lives. 
So let's get to the membership details. We have two levels, Platinum and Platinum Plus. I started out as a Platinum back in 2007 and later upgraded to a Platinum Plus. So the goal is to find you the level that works best for your lifestyle right now. And just like the Wyndham or any other timeshare company sells different plans according to the different amount of weeks you can afford, we also offer two plans. But unlike confusing timeshare, point systems and exchange rules and annoying maintenance fees, we have a clear-cut membership that's easy to use. What we are looking at now are two existing timeshare owners from the Wyndham Cypress Palms who are selling their packages on a reseller website online, which means they probably paid 20% or more when they purchased these packages on the actual grounds, and now they want to sell them and they're doing them a little bit cheaper on this reseller site. The first offer is for $122,500, which equates to about 10 weeks or so of usage each year, and it carries an annual maintenance fees of $4,680. Now, the type of person who purchases this package is usually near retirement age, or they're an entrepreneur who buys a package like this instead of purchasing a vacation home, so they're not locked into one location, but they can spend a week in Florida, then they can spend a week in California, then they can spend a week in Hawaii, then they can spend a week in Arizona. It's like they own mini condos all over the world and that's the type of person that buys this $122,500 package. Now our Platinum Plus package is the most robust vacation offering in the entire travel industry and I believe you'll find it more attractive in price and variety than the 10 week $122,500 Wyndham timeshare package we're looking at right now. It's ideal for people who are ramping up their lifestyle for lots of travel. The Platinum Plus grants a full 20 weeks of usage per year and currently carries no maintenance fees. We have a simple a la carte only pay for the weeks when you use them policy. For many, the Platinum Plus is the alternative to purchasing a retirement home because instead of being locked to one location, our Platinum Plus package gives you 20 weeks of access to over 5,000 fully furnished and maintained resort condos on the best real estate properties all over the world. Amazingly, this 20-week annual membership does not cost $122,000 like the 10-week Wyndham package we just looked at. In fact, the Platinum Plus doesn't even cost as much as a single week of timeshare ownership at the Wyndham Cypress Palms, which as you can see is $16,000 plus maintenance fees. The current 2012 Platinum Plus pricing is locked in right now at $12,500 and this package grants 20 weeks of usage per year with no annual dues and after you complete your initiation fee of $12,500 you have a simple a la carte only pay when you use system. Meaning if you spot a week like this one at the Wyndham Cypress Palms, you only pay 546, which would save you 89.6% off Expedia. And that counts as one of your 20 weeks. You can book vacations in as little as one day notice like I have, and you can book vacations as far out as 11 months. Our weeks currently range from $398 to $799 per week. But like I said earlier, I started out at the introductory Platinum level because A, the Platinum Plus was way out of my price range, B, I didn't need 20 weeks per year, and C, I could actually fit the Platinum membership on my credit cards. Our Platinum membership is arguably the most popular travel membership in the world. The last time I was in Hawaii, I met a group who was selling a similar, I don't want to call it a knockoff package, but it kind of was. They were selling a similar package to tourists at hotel meetings, and they sold an average of 10 to 15 memberships every day, seven days per week at these hotel meetings, and their membership allowed four weeks of usage per year. The average week was $799, and it had a mandatory $250 annual fee to maintain membership. Plus, they had less inventory available than we do inside our Platinum membership. And the tourists were paying $8,995 for access to that membership. And they rightfully felt like it was a great decision instead of owning a timeshare, which it still was. But our Platinum membership offers a generous 10 weeks of usage per year. We have over 5,000 premium resorts in our inventory. We have no annual fee and our weeks are as low as $398 up to $799 in rare cases, and we average about $550 per week, which saves about 80 to 90% off Expedia and Travelocity. 
And our Platinum package isn't $8,995, even though it offers more than that competition in Hawaii does. It's not even $6,995. The current 2012 introductory pricing on the Platinum membership is a one-time initiation fee of only $4,995. It includes 10 weeks of usage per year, no annual fees. It's a lifetime membership. Unlike timeshare owners who pass on the burden of maintenance fees onto their kids, we're able to pass this on to our kids or even onto our friends for a one-time $75 transfer fee. And with the simple only pay when you go system, which as I said, our weeks are $398 to $799 per week, this is a truly private club and the public cannot get access to these prices. But wait, there is more. After selling over $25 million of our Platinum and our Platinum Plus, the consumers, we really listened to them and what everybody said is that why don't we do an even more economy package because 10 weeks are a lot of weeks to use per year and people who are heading into retirement and people who have more flexible schedules, sure they can burn up four or five weeks, but what if we could lower it down to a two week membership? That's how many weeks most people have for vacation. So check this out. This is the Wyndham Ocean Walk in Daytona Beach. Expedia's best price from August 22nd to September 2nd, the two bedroom unit. Look at this nice pool. It's got the water slides. Wyndham's are fantastic. You've got the ocean right here, Sandy Beach. You've got the boardwalk. Expedia's best price is $2,721.96. But inside our Global Resorts membership, you've got the Wyndham Ocean Walk, August 26th to September 2nd, same exact resort, same exact dates. You've got the two bedroom unit, same exact condo size. The only difference is as a member of Global Resorts, you pay $599. This means on one trip, one usage, $2,122.96 saving on one oceanfront premium Daytona Beach condo. So here's what we did. We created a two-week package and we didn't make it $39.95 or $29.95. We actually made the silver package two weeks of annual usage per year for $1,995. That's right, the silver package is $1,995 and on a single use of our membership, like if you use this particular week at the Wyndham Ocean Walk, you would save over $2,000 on a single trip and our silver membership, just like our Platinum and just like our Platinum Plus, are lifetime memberships with no maintenance fees. You pay between $398 to $799 per week and you get two weeks per year. This silver economy package is ideal and if you wanna upgrade later, you can talk to membership services. So we just added this silver package. Let's get back to more on the membership. Our Platinum package is truly amazing. If you look at the Wyndham Bransom at the Meadows, again, this is a reseller website where an owner is selling one week of usage $18,500 and the annual dues that go with it $60 a month it ends up being $729.48 annually on top of the initiation price of $18,500 now here's what's great with our platinum membership at $4,995 you can have access to a week at that exact same resort for less than the cost of the maintenance fees of an owner who paid $18,500. And here's how they sell those timeshares. The Wyndham says, look, if you were to come here not as a timeshare owner, it costs $4,000 for the week, so it's easier to pay $18,500, pay it off in three years, and then you're able to come here for just the maintenance fees of 700 and whatever dollars per year, but inside our club, you don't have to pay $18,500. The initiation fee, $4,995 gets you 10 weeks of access at prices $398 per week up to $799 per week. Let's look at a few more. Hawaii happens to be my favorite travel destination and this is a Shell Vacations Club at, and I'm going to mispronounce that, Paniolo Greens. And this is on the Big Island, the reseller website, one week of timeshare for sale. $14,999 plus $677 in annual fees. Again, we get a better deal than people who paid $15,000. Look what we pay. July 18th to July 25th, which is a premium summer vacation. Two bedroom unit, 
and $98. As a member with Global Resorts Network, I personally feel like I have condos peppered all over Hawaii waiting for me at any time I want. We have 53 different resorts contracted inside Hawaii alone. Let's take a look at a few more. Moving over to Las Vegas, which is ranks about number three in popularity for places to travel. This is a premium winter getaway week, February 18th to the 25th. It's a two bedroom unit. It has the full kitchen. It's, it's actually not a traditional resort property. It's a privately owned unit. It's like literally a private condo within the Marriott. So you get the service of the Marriott staff, but you get a private condo. Look at this. The two bedroom suite, seven nights, if you book directly through the Marriott, and the Marriott, this particular Marriott did not book through Expedia, which is why it's cheaper than some of the Expedia prices we have, $1,403.36. But if you come into our membership, the Residence Inn at the Marriott Las Vegas, same exact week, February 18th to February 20th, same exact unit, two bedroom, except we pay $300 and $74. That's the same resort, the same dates, the same room. The only difference, our club gives you 73.3% off and it's like you literally have condos fully furnished in resort energy areas waiting for you with no maintenance fees at 70, 80, 90% off. Let's look at a couple more. Another peak inside Vegas. Check this out. This is the Wyndham Grand Desert. It's got the granite countertops, the full kitchen, beautiful one bedroom unit. If you went on Expedia's best price guarantee, January 6th to January 13th, $1,252.81. Inside our membership, Wyndham Loss, Vegas, Grand Desert, exact same weeks, exact same unit. The only difference is the price, $398, 68% off. Let's head back over to Orlando. You'll see the, and I'm gonna mispronounce this too, but the Park Solil by the Hilton Grand Vacations Club. This is a beautiful Hilton property. Timeshare ownership for one week on the reseller market, $10,500 plus 500 annual dues, or just think about it. You can just go feel like you're an owner and stay there for $549 in a premium winter getaway with the Hilton Vacation Clubs. As you may have noticed, our club represents a vast portfolio of different resort companies, which makes owning a membership with us more safe than even owning a more expensive timeshare points within any singular company or network, because if one of those companies goes bankrupt through mismanagement or a certain resort gets wiped out in a hurricane or a flood, it could drastically affect you and your membership. But as a member inside GRN, we've seen a number of resorts already, like the Hilton that we just looked at in Orlando. But we've also seen condos from the Wyndham Network, plus the famous Mayan Palace Network of resorts. We saw the Marriott Residence in Las Vegas. And here is the Lawrence Welk Resort in San Diego, which is its own timeshare brand in itself. This is a picture of the actual receipt I got from our travel provider when we booked March 13th through March 20th, a two bedroom unit for $749. Now, here's the cool thing. If you were to look on the reseller market right over here, it's $15,000 for one week of usage every other year. It was a biannual membership of timeshare ownership, 15,000 plus $778 in annual fees each year. And we stayed for less than the owner's annual maintenance fees. Again, our Platinum Plus package at 12,500 with 20 weeks of access to this vast array of resorts is an excellent deal. Our $4,995 Platinum membership that gives me access to this great resort with my family for only $749. It's almost unbelievable. And look, I went on their site here at the Welk Resort in San Diego. I looked at booking the identical dates, which start at March 13th, and then it's kind of covered up here, but you'll see that the total, for, if you bought directly from the Welk Resort themselves, $2,580, and then look what I pay, $749. And this resort is fantastic. You should Google it and look at it. It's got fishing on site. It's got golfing. It's got kids craft time. It has live entertainment. There was a magician when we went there. It has dancing, water slides, it's all right there on site. It's 30 minutes from the ocean, 71% off retail and vastly superior to owning there. 
but I haven't showed many skiing options. So let's take a look at the Vail Run Resort. This is a premium week, February 11th through February 18th. Vail, as you know, or maybe have heard, is really where the fancy skiing is. It's a two bedroom unit. And if you were to buy it on the reseller market right now, $13,500. And if you look down here at the fine print, the maintenance fees and taxes, $251 quarterly. That works out to be $1,004.84 in annual fees for a one bedroom unit. Now check this out. That means that somebody out there paid more than $13,500 for access one time per year to a one bedroom unit and they pay $1,004 annually, even on top of the $13,500. But look what you'll get as a Platinum Plus or a Platinum member. You can use one week, $689, a two bedroom unit, some of the best skiing on earth in a premium week. You are paying less than the maintenance fees of someone who paid $13,500 and you get 10 or 20 weeks of usage per year. While we're on the skiing motif, let's take a look at the lodge at Stillwater, which is right outside of Park City, Utah, which is next to Salt Lake City, which is where the Olympics were for the Winter Olympics. It's some of the best snow and weather conditions on planet Earth, which is why the Winter Olympics were there. If you look at the lodge at Stillwater, I tried to find a premium week online on Expedia or Travelocity. It wasn't available, but I was able to find a premium week which is January 21st to January 28th that's great ski season $398 for the week inside our membership here's what it was on their website if you look the payment due for that same exact week that same exact unit $1781.90 78% cheaper with GRN this is what I mean about when I said that the Platinum membership was the greatest purchase I've ever had. It saves me so much money and it causes us to go create so many memories. You can get started with the Platinum or the Platinum Plus membership. You can do it on a couple credit cards. You can do it on three credit cards. There's information below this video on how to get started. Let's look at another example. Here's another fantastic resort in Southern California called the Worldmark Indio. Worldmark is one of the leading timeshare brands. And what you'll see on this reseller website is a one week annual usage, $17,995 plus $55 monthly in maintenance fee. This is a top ranking property in the RCI exchange. RCI stands for Resort Condominiums International Exchange. It's a premium summer week. If you look July 7th through July 14th, a two bedroom unit, one week usage is 17 995 plus 660 annual for your ownership. As a GRN member, you can enjoy this whole week for less than the cost of the owner's annual maintenance fees, which is $549. This is why people like myself and others often say that their membership was the greatest financial decision of their life. I mean, think about it. Look up here. Instead of paying an upfront investment of $17,995 in a lifetime, of $660 annual dues for one week of usage, and those annual fees are likely to increase. GRN has a much lower one-time initiation fee. It has no annual dues, and it has more annual weeks allowed, whether you're at the Platinum Plus or the Platinum level. Again, we have up to 25% of our buyers already own timeshares and they still become members at our platinum level because we give access to resorts that otherwise they're used to paying ten to twenty thousand dollars for a week for and here within GRN they can just feel like an owner and go to resorts in all the networks and all the brands all across the world I truly believe it is the best travel offering on the face of this planet and that's why I'm pretty passionate about it when you compare us to other clubs, I think you'll find out there's absolutely nothing that touches us. The Inspirato Club is a 30-year term membership, so the cost over the course of 30 years is $103,500. And as you'll see here, there's a one-time upfront initiation fee of $15,000 and annual membership fees of $29,50, and that's before you take a vacation. Now what it does is the club, similar to ours after the initiation fees, gives you member only pricing, think up to 80% off. So let's take a look exactly what they get for the 15,000 initiation fee, the almost 3,000 annual fees. Let's take a look at their rates. 
Here's one of their South Florida properties. It's a two bedroom, two bath, 1,381 square feet. And their discounted rate for seven nights, the total week costs $4,438. Now granted, this is a beautiful condo. Take a look, you'll see the flat screen TVs, you'll see updated furniture, you'll have a great view. But how does this $4,400 week unit compare in style and cost to a similar GRN Resort. We have Joey and Megan who are, they've been Platinum members since 2007. They use the membership all the time and they actually took out the video camera and toured their South Florida condo. See what they paid compared to an Inspirato member. Hey guys, I just want to take you through the suite we've been staying in for the past week. We are in Southwest Florida and the weather has been lovely. This is our dining area. Wonderful table, living area. Uh, we got a nice big TV, a door out to the porch. We've got fans in case it gets too hot. And we also have central air in here. This is our master bedroom. We have big king size bed, TV in here as well. We have a beautiful view out the window and also a door that goes right out to our deck. This is our dressing area. It has a sink, we have a nice big closet, walk-in, filled it with all of our lovely things. And here is our bathroom. We have a really nice shower. Um, it has great tile inside the whole thing. There's a little seat in there. It's super nice to shower in. Um, the counter space is plenty for me to put my girly goods all over. So if you follow me, I will take you through the rest of the place and show you the other rooms. We have an amazing kitchen. It is fully equipped. They give you so many different appliances and it's so much better than staying in a regular little place. They give you all the little accessories like coffee maker, toaster, blender. I was chilling out in here eating my papaya. I have a beautiful view. Look at all those big boats out there. And it's a really, really nice day. We're gonna be getting out on the water and kayaking soon. And this room as well has a TV and a bathroom with a shower. And now I'm gonna take you in Joey's workroom. We have a full washer and dryer in here. Here's his bathroom, which also has a shower. So this is his workroom. We have double beds in here and a cute dog. And, oh my gosh, it is so nice out. This is our lovely screened-in porch that we have. And there's always music playing outside, so it's really nice. And no bugs, because we got our screen here. So, that is it. And I hope you enjoyed the tour. And hopefully you get to stay in a place like this. So, how much did it all cost? Well, here's a rundown for the three bedroom suite from the resort at Marina Village. The suites come with a purchase price of up to $1.4 million. And for an eight day, seven night stay booked through the resort, it added up to be $2,750.58. We did meet people paying the full price and all of the three bedroom suites were booked when we left. Booking the suite online came out to be $2,505.93 for a savings just shy of $250. However, with our Global Resorts Network membership, for the very same week, we paid only $398 total. No additional fees or taxes. So that's a minimum savings of over $2,100. And with our other two vacations booked through GRN that year, we saved over $4,400. I guess you could say we're very satisfied members. As I think you're beginning to see, our Platinum and Platinum Plus members are raving fans because they get to opt out of retail altogether and take advantage of these low private club prices. As I mentioned at the beginning of this video, my wife and I purchased our Platinum membership back in 2007 and we're now Platinum Plus members because this is our alternative to purchasing a vacation home. The cost isn't even close, but I believe the benefits are greater by owning this membership than even a $180,000 vacation home. I'm not kidding. So right now we have thousands of fully furnished condos on the best beaches, on the best golf courses, 
at the best mountains all over the world. It's like we have all the benefits of owning the most premium real estate in the world, but we don't have any of the burden, the risk, or the hassles of the actual ownership. I invite you today to take the next step and become a Platinum Plus or a Platinum member. Signing up takes about seven minutes and we're approved merchants in good standing with Visa, MasterCard and Discover. We use the same secure order processor as Amazon.com. And just on a side note, don't ever purchase a travel membership or a timeshare unit if they require cash payment or bank wires as the only form of getting paid. That is a telltale sign that they don't have a viable product and your investment is unprotected and not covered by the Visa, MasterCard, or Discover's fraud protection program. It's a very important note there. Also, don't ever join a travel club that merely tells you things about how great they are and they're 80% off and they're four-star resorts, but they can't demonstrate for you real examples with real people. Inside this video, we've actually toured through several real condos and shown you actual real-world comparisons so you know exactly the kind of savings and exactly the kind of condos we're talking about. Wyndham's, Mayan Palaces, Hilton, Worldmark, Marriott's, Lawrence Welk's, Shell Vacation Club, and a host of other top-ranking properties featured in the RCI network and the San Francisco Exchange network and other reputable provider of condos. I also did a little bit of scribbling to show you how our shocking prices are actually able to beat Expedia and Travelocity by upwards of 90%. By becoming a Platinum or a Platinum Plus member today, you are able to escape the retail experience of the public who come to each transaction as a singular buyer and therefore have to pay boatloads more. Now listen to this. Your membership allows you to take advantage of super client status, meaning our club cuts out the advertising costs that force resorts to jack up their fees in the first place. Plus, our group buying power gives us special privileges and access because we account for so much more long-term value and volume than a single retail buyer can ever create. And on top of that, we're able to keep our initiation fees so low because we don't require the use of big time expensive television commercials that cost millions of dollars, nor do we spend millions more in marketing overhead like Travelocity and Expedia do because our club is so effective and the deals are so special that it spreads itself primarily through the cheapest and the most effective form of advertising on earth. Word of mouth. People telling people about our club because they got in, they got the savings. This is how we're able to grant 20 weeks of usage with no annual dues for only $12,500, which is cheaper than the average one week of timeshare ownership. Let me end with a true story of a man who was getting ready to retire and he went on vacation to Mexico and when he came back, he bought 15 weeks of timeshare for $70,000. Now when he told his neighbor what he had done, the neighbor happened to be a platinum member with Global Resorts Network. And he did exactly what I just did. He logged in and he showed the guy that just plunked down 70 k all the resorts and the weeks and the price comparisons inside our membership. And he spent that 70 k with one of the brands that I featured in this video, by the way. And because it was still within the seven day period for him to refund, that guy was able to get out of his $70,000 contract and he immediately bought a platinum membership instead, feeling fantastic. I believe our platinum membership has a real world value that is greater than $70,000. And right now, you can grab it for $4,995. If you have more control over your schedule and you want to ramp up the time you spend exploring the world, join us at Platinum Plus for $12,500. Instructions for signing up are below. It's a simple process that takes about seven minutes. If you have any final questions, be sure to use the contact information provided below to get your questions answered immediately by a real person. You'll also be able to book your first week of vacation within seven days of registration. So don't delay. This has been the most rewarding financial purchase I've ever made. And after you start taking these dream vacations for pennies on the dollar, you'll know exactly what I mean. Welcome to Global Resorts Network.